Honestly, the thing that drives me the most crazy, my Tupperware is um, a volcano waiting to explode. I think it's just knowing that I have all this space to store things and that I can't do anything with it. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Declutter with Friends. Today I'm with my friend Sophie and we are going through her cluttered cabinets and junky drawers. It's also declutter in December, so we're gonna attempt to declutter 25 items and get them out the door. There is a free checklist underneath the video you can download if you wanna do your own decluttering. If you're new here, make sure to click the subscribe button for more decluttering and organizing content. Okay, let's get started. Hey everyone, welcome back. I'm here with my dear friend, Sophie. Hi. We met at a fitness class. How did we start talking to each other? We were both at the end of the class saying how hard it was. Oh, that sounds like something I would be saying. Yeah. Or maybe it was like mid push up and we were like, oh. She actually got me going a lot more than I would have gone without her accountability. So thank you for that. No problem. Although I've now since quit. <laughs> <laughs> but we're not gonna talk about that today. Today we're gonna talk about her secret clutter cabinet here in the kitchen. When I look around your apartment overall, I'd say I consider you like a neat person. Yeah, this is where I hide everything. This is like mm. where I keep the facade of being neat, but then everything gets thrown in here. And it's gotten to the point where I can't even close the doors. My messy side is starting to reveal itself. This is her secret. Yeah. She's now sharing it with the internet. This is our idea of a fun hangout. It's a Sunday afternoon and I'm gonna help her declutter and organize. We're gonna take a bunch of stuff out go through it, see what she wants to declutter. Let's do a time check. Will you see what time it is? Yeah. Do you have eight hours? Three days, it's 1223. Okay, would you say you have at least 25 items in here that you will be decluttering? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, donate, trash, or recycle are pretty much gonna be our categories today. I have a lot of cookbooks from like 1999. And the, do they ever get used? No. Okay, so those might be in the declutter yeah. pile. Yeah. Okay, cool, all right, let's get started. I literally just ordered four of these yesterday, but I ordered them because I thought I was out and I could have sworn I had more. Um, but yeah, this happens all the time because everything's stuck in here. It's one of those things where you forget what you have, so you buy it again? Yeah, all the time. All right, we're gathering our supplies. We've got donate, this one will be our donate bag. Yeah. Then we've got plastic bag here for like trash recycle. Yes. Okay, and then we're just gonna use the floor Maybe the table a little bit as our workspace, but we're gonna lay a blanket out on the floor to um, have that be our zone for decluttering. Yeah, I just got a new one. It was, uh, my old one was like five footer, a five footer. That's Frankie. Hi Frankie. What would you like to say for yourself? <laughs> it seems counterintuitive to take everything out and remove it from the cluttered shelf or junk drawer, but it really is the best way to sort through your clutter pick up every item and see if it's really something you want to keep or if it's something you want to get rid of. This is one shelf cleared. Are you shocked at the amount of stuff on one shelf? Mildly horrified. So it's embarrassing to share that over the pandemic, I did do a complete declutter. It recluttered this quickly. It did it by itself, that's what happens. Yeah, and I swear it's not all the weed soda. This might have a role to play though. <laughs> We're gonna go one shelf at a time. So the way that I like to work with people is literally we pick up one item and make a decision about it. Okay. If we're gonna keep it, donate it, trash it. Okay. Like kind of which category do we want it to go into? All right, Missy, let's start making some decisions. Keep. Keeper. What are these? White cotton gloves and you put Vaseline or lotion on your hands and then you wear them to bed and it keeps your hands nice and moisturized. Have you done this? Like once. How long have you had these? Five years. <laughs> Would you like some? This is one of those things I will literally never do. I think I'll keep one pair and then uh, put the rest on my buy nothing group. You can have a buy nothing pile. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. I would like to just wear these out. <laughs> Take two. Hello. Take five. Give them to all your friends. Oh my gosh. They're great if you're robbing a building. <laughs> so right. that's your keep. We'll put these in buy nothing. Yes. Let's put that in the Whole Foods bag there. Old plastic Tupperware. Do you have glass Tupperware? It's What's your mainly, Tupperware situation? I would love to replace this all with glass. So I think anything without a lid, anything that came from a takeout, situation ah uh, so like this one is takeout yes. right okay so that's trash i'm gonna start a trash recycle yeah too. let's start a recycle bag this is a takeout one i think that's the other thing is i'm like oh i don't want to waste so i keep it just sits
Britta's, yes, yes. Shelf riser, yes. I don't know if it's something I actually need though. Um, let's let's wait on this one. Okay. Then. So but, I also have this habit of keeping my old calendars because oh. I think, well, I might want to hang these up one day. It's 2022, I see. Yeah. So it's expired. How how are you going to use this? I feel like at some point I might want to hang these up. Maybe when I'm 62, <laughs> when I own a house. Planning for the future. Yeah. So those, those are a keep. It sounds like. <laughs> okay. I'm emotionally attached to these. This is quite old, so I think I'm gonna toss this. Oh, what is that? It's a dosis pen. What is it's that? It's like a weed pen. When oh, I work okay. my super stressful oh, like job, a, I would go like a vapor hide in pen? the bathroom and do it. <laughs> Classic soul. Classic soul, keep. 21 day sugar detox. Did it, maybe would do it again. Keep? Keep. Radically simple. <sighs> keep? Okay, we're gonna do rapid fire on the books. Keep or keep. donate. Keep. Keep. Uh, I'm gonna keep that one. I think maybe that's a donate. Woohoo, donate, goodbye. Bartender's Black Book. I used to be a bartender in Brooklyn. Yeah, this is like the one that you get when you go to bartending school or something. Yeah, is I never it? went to bartending school. I just dated the manager. Yeah. Um, I'm going to keep the bartending book. Okay, that's oh, a key. Geez. Yonana's recipe guy. This is something. Oh, I already gave away my Yonana's, so that can be a toss. Trash. Or a recycle. Recycle. I have so many recipes that I like found hidden in my... How about this one? 15-minute chicken gourmet. I doubt it. I, I think I'm going to donate it. So I want to take out everything that's in it. This can be tossed because that expired. Oh, this expired a few years so ago. So this was from, I don't have a Costco card, but my friend had a Costco card and I was so overly excited that I bought 52 packets of oatmeal. And I kind of <laughs> wish I had donated it to somebody who actually could have used it when it was, but I don't think I can donate it when it's that expired well, yeah years ago. this is her dad's book what is it about oh it's good it's a thriller it's about <gasps> a uh psychic like what? a medium yeah does he have a ton of books yeah yeah he's a really good writer yeah this sounds like the kind of book i like to read oh yeah i i, I love thrillers it's always a good test of a book if i can read it in a weekend yeah and i can read those in a weekend Ooh. Ooh. um this is actually insane. I feel like I've gotten rid of so much already. And I feel really good for being able to like make those quick decisions. Do you see how quickly it goes? Yeah. That was probably 20-ish minutes yeah. on one shelf. So we're gonna, we are gonna pick up the pace a little bit. We are gonna pick up the pace. Decluttering cupboards and junky cabinets and things like that, I feel like it's difficult in the sense that there's a mishmash of random stuff. So it's very tedious to go through every single item, but it's easier in a lot of ways because it's a lot of stuff that you're either using or not. It's not sentimental or things you're attached to. Clothes to me are way harder to declutter. This revolutionary product makes doing laundry so much easier. I wanna thank Earth Breeze for sponsoring today's video. Earth Breeze these eco sheets are liquidless laundry detergent. They dissolve 100% in hot or cold water and they work amazingly well. This single envelope fits enough detergent for up to 60 loads of laundry. And what a perfect gift this holiday season to make your life easier and have a more convenient laundry experience. That's why I switched to Earth Breeze a year ago and have not looked back. It's not only more convenient, but it's better for the planet and it's a major space saver. I also love no more measuring out detergent or carrying heavy jugs home from the store. Most importantly, Earth Breeze fights everyday stains and odors and you still get a powerful clean. Earth Breeze has a flexible subscription. You can pause or cancel at any time. And with every purchase, they donate 10 loads of detergent to a charitable cause of your choice. Earth Breeze is dermatologist tested, hypoallergenic, and free of bleach and dyes. I would really love for you to give them a chance. And if Earth Breeze is not your thing, you don't even have to return it. Just let them know and you'll get a full refund, no questions asked. Go to earthbreeze.com slash the Carla Project to get started with 40% off. That's earthbreeze.com slash the Carla Project for 40% off your subscription today. Thanks to Earth Breeze and thanks to you guys for checking them out. Let's get back to decluttering. This has become the keep station. We know all of this stuff is being kept. This is shelf number two that we're gonna start sorting through. See what else we're ready to let go of before we start putting things back. This one feels a little more manageable. Pink candle. I feel like it's handy to have in case we have a blackout. I feel like I should vaguely be a survivalist. Did you watch <laughs> that movie, Leave the World Behind? I sure did. I really liked it. I know it was like mixed reviews, but I liked it too. I really enjoyed it. And I thought it was shot so cool. Yeah. And just like styled so beautifully. And after that, I should have at least something in my house to be right? somewhat prepared when they were filling up the tub with water. I don't even have extra water. I need to be more prepared. Vaz. Uh, keep. Fan. 
It's pretty. Donate. Buy nothing. I got this at a flea market. It's a vintage Pyrex. I was cooking with it for years and I found out through a friend that apparently there's lead in it. So it's like highly toxic oh when gosh. you cook it. Do you want to keep the dish? One day when I have a big kitchen, I'll just display it as like a relic, yeah. a vintage relic. These are all my paper files, which I feel like I have to hang on to for right now. Lights. Okay, that's a keep. How about these little jars here? I think I'll keep these. Keep, I keep. Use these. This too? It's just taking up space. Okay, do you want to buy nothing these? I'm going to buy nothing those. Okay, take that one. That one. Okay, this looks like an organized little oh, my woo -woo box. saging box. Yeah. I like how you have that organized. Sage Palo Santo. Oh, what about your other? You want to put your other Palo Santos in here? You had more. Oh, I did, yeah. Here. Good for your allergies. Though. No, I know. <laughs> I'm so boring. I can't handle anything. Baggy, the cute little thing. Cute, 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 Because you cute. can't be from Los Angeles and not have a box of woo, -woo You got to have a box. Yeah. I have a whole drawer. Yeah. I, I have more than a drawer. 134, so we're about one hour into this. That's pretty good, actually. Yeah, how are you feeling? I, I feel good. I you, feel like we've we've tossed a lot of things. I've been able to let go. Yes, you are doing a good job of yeah. letting go. Oh, good, okay. Yeah, why do you feel like you get emotionally attached to items? Yes, but I've been better as I've gotten older. Okay, yeah. I feel like you're doing a very good job. That's our recycle bag, our trash bag, and this is our buy nothing bag. I'm taking this home with me. I always leave someone's house with something, and I love these moleskin notebooks so this is now mine thank you sophie you're welcome yeah 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 this is how it's looking so far. We've got two shelves organized. We're gonna move up here to shelves three, four, and five. I feel like I can actually, like I, I feel like breathing is easier just looking at this. Isn't it crazy how a closed space, like a cabinet, you actually feel better mm -hmm. knowing that it's been cleaned out and organized? Yeah, it's it really is. pretty incredible. <laughs> I have, like, my DVD collection stops whenever Netflix started. I probably should get rid of some of these. What's that? Probably keep, like, my Mary Tyler Moore Show collection. Oh, yeah, okay. And Return to Oz. Classic. Memento, probably classic not streaming. Things. Okay, there's definitely some things that can be given away here. Christmas candle. I was looking for this the other day. You were? Cat stuff. Cat stuff. Another DVD. I actually totally use these all the time. That's the, this thing. This thing? <laughs> Can I leave this up here? Cause it's just heavy. Yeah, and... big water jug. Yeah, for okay. all the parties I don't throw. Maybe I'll do a quick yeah, wipe, wipe down. down. Just water I think will be fine. Adler candle. Oh, let me see, how does it smell? can do it just because I'm so like fragrant sensitive yeah but I, this is pretty you should put it out in your bathroom or donate it yeah either yeah. do you know you don't think you'd use it oh that's that's a horrible. nice <laughs> <laughs> well we got one empty one that's a is it a big thing that's a bad thing that I had this many like this is like an old technology it's time to it's time to get rid of everything but love actually and Bridget Jones oh yeah but all on Amazon Prime right for... meet the parents mm -hmm. Okay, let me get rid of a bunch of these. Okay, so you, I'm gonna let you sort through these okay. if you wanna have a, a seat. I'll hand you your DVD boxes. So I'm gonna give her the DVD boxes to sort through and while she does that, I'm just gonna go through some of the stuff that's sitting on the tabletop. Is Bridget Jones still streaming? Your Beatles anthology, did you want these? I think I'm gonna... Buy nothing? 
by nothing. Okay. How's so, the DVD decluttering going? What have you gotten rid of really and what have you good. kept? Um, I feel like I've narrowed it down to just a couple that may not be streaming anymore. Is this your goodbye pile here? This one? Um, this is my goodbye pile. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Bravo. So maybe somebody wants these. I mean, like Bridesmaids, one of the best movies ever, but Absolutely. totally streaming. Yes. So, so I we've narrowed got it one, down two, three, from four. six to four. Good job. Outdated technology. Yay. Um, You're innocent. I mean, these are really old nail polishes. This one I bought in high school at Brooks Pharmacy in Massachusetts for $5, and it's definitely from the 90s, vintage. Vintage nail polish. I think maybe I'll just toss a bunch of these. This one that is now orange instead of pink. I'll get rid of this box. That's good. You got rid of like 20 oh nail polishes. God. Old hard drive. I don't even know what's on it. Oh, it's a charger. This is super old. Buy nothing yet. Someone might want that. I don't even know if it works anymore. Oh yeah, it does. I mean, it turns on. Yeah. Okay. I'll buy nothing it. Oh, off. is this your old Polaroid? Yeah. Okay, I got so that through buy nothing. And I wonder if this would sticky. fit in. old Christmas decor. Yeah. And like old wires. Again, vintage technology. Okay. Yeah. DSL cables. I think probably most of this can be tossed. This could be the toss bag. Again, another toss bag if it's all going to be tossed. I like that idea. Can you be honest with me and tell me if this has seen better days? Better days, I'd say. Okay. I bought this at Target and I lived in Brooklyn and I shipped it across the country. <laughs> Farewell, little tinsel tree. Oh, it feels bag. so good. Yes, goodbye. So We're good. clearing energy for the new year. Woo! It's the best time of year to do this. Like, you'll use more often, so we should have them lower, right? Don't you use these? Yeah, I think on the second level. No, are these? those are just other jars. Okay. I think I saved this one because I like it. Okay. I think it's pretty. And then... See that to me, this says this this woman has her shit together. That right? says I'm an organized woman. I'm a boss. Yeah. I have boxes. I, I at least have the facade of having my life together. <laughs> a calendar? Is that a Yeah, or? I know I like to make cards out of calendar. Maybe I'll hang on to Oh, it. do you want to keep this one? This is a charger, phone charger? In case the world ends. Okay, have this, is a, this is a survivalist yeah. material right here. The oh. last, what, what is that movie called? Both just watched Leave the World Behind. This is for her Leave the World Behind shelf. Yeah. This is the survivalist shelf. This is a toss, I think. Okay, toss. Oh, that's also for Leave the World Behind. Oh yeah, life straw. You can put it into I, dirty water and it'll, you'll be able to drink it. I, do you want these? No, okay. I won't use it. Nail stickers. Are we? Are you think? Are you thinking you're? Well, I'm just. I'm never gonna see them as the thing. Yeah. Do you and want so... those in your bathroom, or where do you do your nails? When I do, I do them at the nail salon. She's like, do you want them? And I was like, I don't do my nails at home. She's like, you don't. Turns out you don't do them at home either. No. Maybe I'll just keep this out for five minutes and like. Okay. Think yeah. About let's things. keep those out. Yeah. I don't think I need the directions. I can look it up online, right? What about this? Um, that was from my trip to India. I think. All of this can be tossed. Okay. This was from a company I worked for. In Japan, broken objects are often repaired with gold. Oh, yeah. Consider this when you feel broken. Mm. But also, they laid me off, so. The bad memory associated with that. They're like, you're broken and you're fired. <laughs> Here's a card, though. I'm just kidding. <laughs> More nail stickers. All right, I'm going to toss. <laughs> On a scale of 1 to 10, how good am I at throwing out things? You're really good, actually. Oh, good. Huh? Yeah. Getting rid of things that you know you're not going to use. More than 25 things. Uh, way more than 25 things. You really actually are thoughtful about the things that you're keeping or letting go of. I am also quite, oh, that is a petty. I am also quite pretty on the inside. Um, I think I got that as a gift. This could be a good catch-all for- Yeah, lots of little random things. Yeah. <laughs> quickly go through these bottom cabinets and just kind of sort through things. Well, maybe it was fate when you walked in the door. I could have sworn I've seen your face before. So glad that you 
We're gonna do this as a dedicated drawer for all of her kitty cat supplies and treats and things and just organize it. And we'll go through each one of these four drawers. Kitty cats have their own drawer now with all their treats and greenies and supplies. Her linen drawer looks good actually. And these are all treasured used we're keeping that as is and it closes this feels so much better okay wait let me see it Ooh. all right what, what is happening here i think this, this has one? become a storage for bags this is greeting cards this could probably be brought out or what are these like um these are just all like i mean so many of these can probably be tossed yeah let's toss some of these I mean, I can use them as shopping bags, but I feel like I already have so many of those. Yeah, put a cap on your reusable shopping bags. Do you ever use those? Those are like a no. weird material for shopping. Any of these that you want? This um, one you probably want to keep, huh? Yeah, I'll keep or these. Are these glossier? These ones? Oh, well, yeah, this can all be tossed. How about some of these yes. things? Toss, 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 toss. This as well, probably. Toss. I, I hang on clearly to too many. This is um, um, Christmas cards can go elsewhere. This is the tiny cat This. Tent. You know what? I'm going to save this for... What is it? It's like just a like bag, reusable bag? Okay. This one? I'm going to toss. This is a big difference. Huge difference on that one. Okay, it's 345. This is the last drawer. We're gonna rapid fire go through this and then we're pretty much done. Keep on drinking. We keep on wishing. We keep on drinking. We keep on wishing. All those little moments. The best you did catch me looking over your shoulder. This is her organized chaos junk drawer where she knows where everything is. I told her if she can get even like two shoe boxes, it'll just help to compartmentalize some of the stuff. So we did that drawer. This is a big difference. Huge difference on that one. Kitty cat drawer. This looks great. Yeah, this is perfect. So I have not been able to actually close these all the way in a really long time. This is incredible. I like don't even know what I'm gonna do with these middle two shelves with all that extra space. You have so much extra space yeah. and things are really well organized. So how was the process for you? Exhilarating. Yeah, don't you feel so great? And it, it just helps to have somebody to kind of guide, like having you guide me through the process made it so much faster and helped my decision making. I really hope that I can keep this this clean. And we've got, this is trash, right? Trash. Trash. Three bags of trash. 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 This is buy nothing zone. And then recycling. Buy nothing. And the there's middle. recycling here. Yeah. Recycling. All of that stuff, shockingly, was hiding in those cupboards. Whether you set a timer for 20 minutes to toss trash or you set aside an afternoon to go through your cupboards and your junk drawers, Decluttering at this time of year is so powerful. You feel the energy change. We've got an opportunity for a new year and that means new things coming in. So get rid of the old. If you don't love it, if you're not using it, if it's just taking up space, get it out of your home, get it out of your life. Aim for 25 items. I feel like all of us can go through our homes and find 25 items to declutter. Don't forget there is a free checklist under the video that you can download to guide you as you go through decluttering the random items in your home. We did it. We're done. We finished. You're happy with everything? I am 
beyond thrilled and beyond grateful. It's 4.08, so that was a good solid four hours of work. I feel like we maximized mm -hmm. the space. Yeah. It's, it's a good stash of stuff that's gonna be leaving. So it's a combination of Recycle, Buy Nothing Group. Join your local Buy Nothing Group on Facebook. Facebook it's Buy Nothing. the best thing ever. A lot of this stuff will find good homes. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you think of her cabinet transformation and see you in the next episode. Bye. Bye.